Not as well like one hub after like same similar to like how Quake basically like Quake One between the episodes you have like a hub. Basically like that, same like with difficulty selection and stuff. We're now in the hub thing, so we just completed this. So we completed the first three episodes. So we can see that um Oh, it doesn't say that I completed them all. That's a... a little bit loud. That's probably better, I think. Sacred path. Did I complete that? I forgot which episode. I think I just completed that one. It sucks that it doesn't show me anymore which one I, I completed. Naked water of the gateway heals all wounds. Nice. In expanse. Dude, I really don't know which one to do. Maybe I'll check the codex. Places. Astral Equinox. Domain of the Sentinels. The Sacred Path. Domain of the Sentinels. Okay. So what we completed is... Again, Gateway of the Ancients. Domain of the Sentinels. Sacred Path, what? Domain of the Sentinels. This is so confusing. Yeah, the sacred path is where I gotta go. Astral Equinox. But that's where the beginning, because I want to show you the beginning places first. Down here. Oh, I, I, I now know where I am. Okay. Okay, I remember. So this is where we started. Okay. Now I'm back. To, I'm back to knowing where I am. So this was the first. Here was the first episode. Now I'm back to where, where we are. To where I know where I am. Yeah. Then I unlocked this, which was the second. No, the third. I don't even know the order anymore. Fuck that. But we did that. Then this opened up. Now I see. And we did the forges, I think. Did we? No. Forge out this way later. Astral Equinox. They, oh no, I did the sacred path. So I need to go to the solar. Oh, God, fuck. Damn it, man. So I did that. That's gonna be locked, I think. Solar solstice is open. No, I did. Do what? I did do the four. Dude, I don't know. I guess. I guess there's no order. What the fuck? Guys, I am so confused. Servants of the Sun. No, I didn't do the... 
Oh, I did do this. Yeah, I killed these guys. Was it like an episode too early? I didn't... Yeah, because I didn't fight these. Oh, did I? Guys, I am confused. I am conf Maybe I did complete four episodes. I am, I, I am so fucking confused. I am confused. I'm, I'm uh, for some fucking stupid reason. It doesn't show me which ones I've completed yet. And yesterday it did so it show it. But I guess there's no real order then. I'm just all allowed to do everything. Guess I need to do this. Maybe when I get back it shows it again. I don't know. Okay. So, do you know, do you know the Tome of Power in Heretic? Basically, I'm picking up souls, and whenever I pick up a soul, you can see a little bar, a little blue bar, below my health. When that fills, I can activate basically what is effectively a Tome of Power. I've already tried out all weapons with that, so I know how each weapon already handles how. How? Well, these fuckers uh, don't fuck around. That's why we're playing on hard difficulty. Here's proof. Uh, art. Proof. I really forgot if I did three or four episodes last night. So here's the first weapon. Uh, this is like weapon slot two. The staff. It shoots homing balls. The third one is a sword. Which can slice through multiple enemies. I really hope after we finish this, it'll show me which episodes I've completed. Fuckers have shields, man. These guys are annoying. Shields are annoying. I learned that lesson from Hexen. Oh wow, we're getting slot six. Slot six is a staff that shoots uh, ice shards. like that. Oh, and it pins enemies to walls as well. Sun brings warmth and good life to those who would worship. Oh, we've unlocked... Yeah, you see the purple uh, thing at the bottom. That's basically the Tome of Power thing we can activate now. Two cents to reach gold.
but I want to use the uh, tome thingy in when I need it. Probably one of the most badass weapons ever. You see this orb? These orbs I shoot. If you're wondering what these orbs are, well, you're gonna be surprised what these orbs are. This is the description of this weapon created by the Archmage of Chaos. It pulls random planets from their position in time and space then shrinks them down to a size so that they can be launched at foes. Hell yeah. Yeah, I actually got an achievement for shooting the Earth last night. The Earth is in there, so yeah. Also, uh, this is referring to the soul charge, the Tome of Power thing. When enough souls have been gathered, their power enables the claw enough might to fire even a sun. So basically, you shoot stars. a badass weapon but it's probably not my favorite my favorite weapon is probably this thing the volt ride it's a trident it's called the volt ride I mean I don't think I need to explain what it does go overkill on someone there's gonna be lightning strikes yep uh, if like if you do an overkill kill like this there's, there's like an overkill system where if you keep shooting someone that dies you get overkill or something so basically lightning strikes if you do overkill and that electrocutes a lot of enemies that are near it and with the Tome of Power, this basically shoots a big lightning beam. Which is super satisfying. See, that was the lightning strike right there. <laughs> one on the right exploded because I killed one on the left. Good shit. But yeah, this is probably my favorite gun, favorite weapon of the game. Uh, we're already on six weapons. We only have to. We only need the B of G still. One, the lunar worshippers who must be silenced. Their heresy knows no bounds. Our time is at hand.
Very much wrecked. Silver key. There's darkness on the horizon. I have kept the key here for safekeeping. Guard it well, brothers. My key now. We're back here. Nice. As for ammo, there's uh, four different mana types. So there's the blue mana, which is used by the staff and the trident. There is the green, the weed mana, which is used by the sword thing and the ice thing. Then there's two other manas, which is the orange, which is for the planets, and the purple for the bivge. Uh, orange, blue, green, and purple. Almost. <laughs> also, I should not pick this up because this instantly fills my souls to max, but I already have utmost max, so... I'll try to use it, uh... Soon. More souls. So yeah, this souls mechanic kind of reminds me of, uh... Painkiller, where you pick up souls. Good thing the souls don't disappear in this uh, game, unlike Painkiller. Not good. Those fucking shields, man, are the worst. What to say? The night brings sadness. Man, this is a sorrow we're talking to. Sad. So sad. Now we picked out Legendary Soul. Got maxed again. God damn it, like the top of my head here keeps fucking itching. Do a better jump. Where's the uh, orange mana piece thing? Those shards don't bounce off. That's good. Oh man, I could have used the fucking uh, soul power thing. 
I didn't do it. <gasps> Both good. This is the Bovka. I know it looks very weird. But it's basically a BFG. And when powered up, it's basically a black hole launcher. Yep, that's how it's called. Damn it, bot, stop spamming. Am I going the right way? I need to get up to the thing. Study the light a revelation is at hand. That's the black hole. What's so. up? Sun gives us sight for which to fight. Bring on the night. Yeah, this attack seems to be pretty special. I really like the UI in this game as well. It's nice and simple. I can see all the weapons I have, I can see all the ammo I have in the bottom. Just like, you know, it's very good and effective, just like Doom, gives you all the info you need. sounds are also very satisfying in my opinion. Remind me of Jazz Jackrabbit and uh, and also of uh, Maximo versus the Army of Zin. Oh, 
Whoa, what the fuck? Can't even scratch. the exit my eyes stained by dark vision I shall seek guidance at the tower yeah this sign means exit Illumination complex. <laughs> Those lightning strikes never get old. can read lots of things in the codex. Um, all weapons in the medieval complete contain a gem that empowers them with the ability to use the soul of a fallen enemy. Once you have collected enough souls, you may enter soul mode. The weapons will unleash their true power. Click on the arrow at the bottom right to find out about each weapon. Yeah, this is the axe of the Black Labyrinth, a weapon created by the god by the old gods themselves. It has belonged to many great warriors and heroes. It senses evil and at a short distance it will pull anything that it hates. Yeah, this axe actually pulls enemies towards you. Also, key to traversing dimensions. Its full powers are unknown. It always returns back to the labyrinth once the wielder is dead. Is the staff of the Azur Orb. The great wizards of the Azur Order crafted a perfect orb re representing all they stood for. Purity and balance contains facets of their combined powers. Normally it fires seeking magic orbs. When powered it unleashes a torrent of magic and it will turn enemies into water. Whispers Edge. Celestial worshippers created this weapon in secret. There are many similar swords, but the pure green energy of the Whisper's Edge tears through those who would stand in its way. The projectile it fires will strike multiple enemies if hit on the sides. A direct hit deals more damage. And the powered up version actually cuts through enemies a lot quicker and like bounces off and shit. Voltride. A once common weapon was used by holy warriors of the lands of lightning to subdue their foes by keeping them in a state of shock. Once an enemy has been hit enough times, they will enter a state of overcharge. The state can only be held for a few moments or the body will accumulate too much energy and disperse, casting deadly chain lightning. Celestial Claw already read that one. Star of Torment, one of the forgotten weapons of the Crystal Warriors, it fires part of their very essence at foes. The star launches shards that are powerful enough to crucify enemies. Powered by souls, it will fire the entire cluster and seek enemies. When it hits an enemy, nearby foes may be struck by errant shards. And the Aeternum, no one knows where this weapon of exceptional power came from. It is set to exist in many dimensions at the same time. The Eternum will fire a projectile a short distance before exploding and instantly hitting nearby enemies with beams of magic. It's best to aim where the projectile will hit as many enemies at once. When powered, it fires a black hole. 
simple. Who doesn't like firing black holes? This is effective versus the shield dudes, I like it. Water releases number one. Oh, it's crucified behind there. Okay, so we need to release some Wata. Releasing the Wawa. Weapon kicks ass. Also, you can't run in this game. And you can shoot the lightning underwater as well without killing yourself. gold key Need the gold key heretics fate
So where are the gold key at? Where you guys uh, hid the key? Lightning strikes twice. Watch your steps. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Holy crap, it's Toaster. Welcome, bro. How you doing? I got the Kranwagen today in World of Tanks. Good man. Watch your steps. Maybe I gotta watch at the steps. Maybe there's a secret in the steps. Oh, I thought I was using the Oh, I'm out of that. Oh, it's like, why am I... Why is the... My weapon selection was acting weird, but it's because I'm out of mana. Damn. That's why I chose the BFG. <laughs> Basement dwellers. Oh boy. We don't even have a basement. <laughs> Gotta be some secret here, right? Secret, ancient Chinese secret somewhere. Was oh. Johnson. This is the first time getting this power up for me. We're flying, we're flying.
what I thought. Parents in the 90s, you should go out more and start a career with video games. Boy. I mean, it's not that streaming is my career, sadly, but yeah, you can in theory do it. It's gotta be a bit lucky and dedicated, I guess. Oh man, that feels so good. Yeah. I mean, I have titties, but not the right kind of titties, I think. that sound that the culprit don't hear the sound anymore that was the culprit that key <laughs> that was close holy fuck you fucking see that <laughs> Sorry, sorry, please no one follow. Getting back to gaming. See, I'm gaming. Playing games, playing games. Definitely playing games here. Ah, you don't have a gold key. Now you don't have a head. <laughs> Almost. Was right in time.
That didn't go very well. <laughs> Beware of burning all those calories when moving the mouse. You just blew up the earth on the top there. See? Just blew up the earth. Are you calling me fat? <laughs> Mods, please ban this 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 bigot. He's calling me fat. Oh man, I used to play that. to free some more Wawa. I think. Damn, these spears hurt. They're sticky. Ah, I need silver key. That's the exit. Uh, but we probably need to, yeah, we need to flood the place so that we can swim up there. God fucking reflect this asshole. Weapon is so good. Shield for a Your shield is useless. All right, what was that one uh, silver button?
Nice stun lock. Oh crap, I can't get up here. Ugh. Fuck my life. To go through all this garbage again. Oh wow! Dude, this weapon is so powerful, we fucking crucified that guy against the air. We killed him so hard, but there was no wall, so the magic was like, oh, we don't need no wall, we'll just crucify him in the air. That's fucking amazing. Let there be flood. That's why he's lightning. This almost reminds me of Snake Way. Or Goku running on Snake Way almost. Oh, that's cool. So it doesn't auto switch to the uh, basically rocket launcher when you're out of ammo, just like Doom does. I'm very good at games, at video games. Get me power, do it, baby. He got, he got like crucified against the stairs here. So everyone can welcome him. He's crucified like fucking, you know, like the welcoming man. I don't know how, how that's called. This is your place. Do you live here? It's your house. Yeah, those look pretty supreme. Uh, the greeter. Mm, juicy.
juicy. Betrayed, I rest, the light is for God. to encounter the earth and I'll fire it away right away. I can scroll through planets like this until I find the earth. Should we look for the earth? If it's... Oh no, it's already blown up so I don't know if we can get it again. Definitely, yeah, uh, having uh, a bit less ammo compared to the uh, other episodes. Maybe I'm just spamming more. But, uh... I've been wondering... What do you guys think? Do you guys think this game is true to call itself an old school shooter? Because I think it is. Yeah, why can't I play Quake on my PlayStation? On controller. Seriously, like so many troll posts on Quake Champions forums and stuff about wanting controller support. Hey, you almost hit me. Hey, you almost hit me, dude. Watch out. Crucify him into the air. Yeah, that's true. I saw Camel play uh, at least a Quake 2 version, I think, on Nintendo 64. But I also think this game has the gameplay. <laughs> Movement is fast. Lots of dodging required. Quick text adventure. What should I do now? Strafe. What should I do now? Strafe. What should I do now? Strafe. Oh, we got the gold key. Hi. Goodbye, cruel world. Zork. Who is Zork?
game. They could play a game within Call of Duty. Oh, that's nice. Oh, so okay. Yeah, that's always fun when there's like games within games. Like, uh, Wolfstone 3D. Oh, he just killed his fucking teammate. Now I did switch to rocket. A very old computer, I think. So the body parts don't disappear, they just stay here. That's pretty cool. Because I haven't really noticed any frame drops or anything. This game is pretty well optimized. Rings? Are we gonna play Sonic now? Oh, Superman 64, we're flying through rings. Damn it. Piece of shit. Did I kill him? Yeah, I did. Killed him until he was dead. Oh crap, that's a super health. Boys.
But I'm using the staff to, like, not use up my ammo as quickly. Because it doesn't consume as fast. But it also homes in, so yeah. That's a very nice addition with the flying enemies. Or works very well against flying enemies. Staircase. Go, 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 staircase. Staircase. La la la. Superman, go! <laughs> oh. You guys are mean. That was too close. Anybody have screen? What kind of screen? On the screen. Oh, there you go. Welcome back, Light. Alright Toaster, you have a good night of sleep man, thanks for chilling, appreciate it. Have a uh, safe passage to the other week, may your Monday not be shitty. Sleep well. Alright, I went the wrong way, oh I gotta go up. stuff. Oh fuck. Not safe. Oh, 
Holy fuck. I almost died there. Oh. The fucker's still alive. Collect more ammos. Crap, there's a free legendary soul right there. Aw, should have used it. Though the exit's right there. Boss time. The saint awaits from his home at the sun. We're gonna kill him with suns. as planned. The fuck? I don't think uh, shooting suns at him works. Oh, he kills me like super easily. I have like no time this to get health while fighting this guy. Thank <laughs> you. 
It's only uh, isn't so bright here anymore. Got him. Welcome back, champion. All right, so it says again what we have completed and what not. Oh. Oh, this is not good. We're doing it like out of order, it seems. Because I only got the Sacred Path and the Arcane Expanse left. So episode 3. Episode 7. Oh. I need to do the sacred path, which I should have done a long time ago. See, we're out of order. <laughs> but they let me do it in the order I wanted to, so I guess that's fine. I can choose however I wanted to. really unique that I get to choose the episodes uh, kind of in that order that I want to except for the last one that's not unlocked yet uh, yeah, I think that's I think I'll uh, leave it at that for today with this game because I, I, I already did like three episodes last night more medieval uh, I think three more episodes to go yay very good game <laughs>